What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. So today we're going to go over how to properly store your cowboy boots. How to store them, why you would want to do so, and why you want to rotate them. And I'm going to also show you guys how I like to store my boots. Now before I show you guys that, don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button below. And ringing that bell, it won't hurt either. Now let's jump into how to store your cowboy boots. Okay, so why do you want to properly store your uh, cowboy boots or even just uh, your footwear, any pair of shoes in general? Well, you want to store them properly so that air can um, flow freely into the uh, boot and uh, around the boot. That way it dries out properly. You don't want to have a lot of moisture locked into this material because what's going to happen is over time, if it stays moist from the your feet sweating or from walking through water all the time this is actually going to start to mold mildew it'll even start to crack and dry out and you don't um you don't want that so you want to store them properly so that they're getting good airflow so that all the moisture leaves the um material now how you can actually do that is pretty simple actually you can either do it on a shelf or on a uh, shoe rack or boot rack depending on what you got going on as far as your footwear goes and you want to rotate them too that way the boot or shoe has time to uh, dry out you don't want to wear the same pair of boots or same pairs of shoes uh, two days in a row you want to alternate wear one pair this day one pair the next day at least give each pair a day in between to uh, dry out now where you can actually store these at is actually going to be um, where you can put your sh shoe rack, boot rack, or shelf at. Is You can even put it in your closet, you can put it in a corner somewhere, just somewhere that air is going to be flowing to. The closet's fine as long as it's not like a sealed airtight closet, which nobody really has that, so you're good. Airflow does get in through your closet. If you don't feel like it's getting enough, just leave the door cracked for a little bit and you'll be good. Now, for your nicer ones that you like to keep set aside and only wear on certain occasions, it's uh, fine to actually store them in the original box that they came in or just a box in general. You don't want to have um, any plastic or anything like that in there with them, but just putting the boots or shoes back into the box that they came in is perfectly fine as long as they're dry beforehand. And you can achieve that by letting them sit out overnight. You know, Just leave them sit out overnight. That would make sure they're dried and cleaned off and then... Put them in the box until you're ready to um, uh, wear that again. Now, how I like to personally store my boots, and I'm going to show you guys that here in a minute once I change my camera angle over, but I actually like to store them on a uh, little shoe shelf that I had gotten off uh, Amazon, I think, for like 20 25 bucks. I'll include the link for that in uh, the description below. So give me one second to jump over to the corner here, and I'll show you guys what I use to store my boots with. Okay guys, so this is how I store my cowboy boots. It was, it's a, uh, made by Closet Made, it's 31 inches long, and it was actually uh, $35, I apologize. I had said uh, $25 earlier in the clip, earlier in the video, but it was uh, $35. And this is the uh, dark cherry version. They also have a black, or an espresso, I think, and a white one also, I believe. And the prices will vary depending on which one you get, but mine was the Dark Cherry 31 inch for the $35. And you can see I have a little shelf down there that I keep my uh, boot care uh, items in, in that little box. And I was not lying whenever I said I have four of the same pairs of boots. Now how I'll rotate them is actually pretty simple. Usually I have this in a closet, but I brought it out into my living room just to show you guys the full view of it. But what I'll do is I'll just start on the end, take the pair I'm going to wear for that day. And you can see I actually have my belts in there like I showed you in my how to store your belts video. And after I grab the pair I'm going to wear, I'll move the other ones down. And after I wear them for the day, I will put the ones I had worn. There we go. At the end. And repeat process. All right, so we're back up here now. That wraps up our video on how to store your cowboy boots 
or any of your footwear for that matter in general. Um, the shelf I had actually showed you guys that I store my boots on, it's actually stackable so you can get multiple ones and um, stack them on top of each other. So if you're going to use them for your boots and stack them like that, you probably don't want to put that um, second shelf on that you've seen at the bottom of mine. Just leave that off. But they are stackable. And like I said, that is the uh, Dark Cherry Closet Made uh, shoe shelf that I gotten off Amazon for $35. So that wraps us up. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope this video helped you guys out on how to store your boots and gave you guys some ideas. Please let me know in the comments below how you uh, like to store your cowboy boots. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. I'll see you in the next one. You take care.